Once the machine is removed from the box, the vacuum cleaner will then need to be assembled. Place the base of the machine on the floor and fit the body as shown. It slips in place and locks automatically. Fit extension tube and hose. A crosshead screwdriver is required to fit the accessory clamp to the handle. This holds the crevice nozzle. The machine is now ready for use. Brush roller height can be adjusted for carpet type using the height adjustment knob. The machine is switched on with the button located on the front of the handle. Release foot pedal to activate the brush roller motor. Green light will illuminate on the base of the machine. When using the machine, try to move your body rather than just arm movements to reduce fatigue. The machine picks up to the edge on the right hand side only. For awkward places, use the extension hose and crevice nozzle as shown. Vacuum bag replacement. Open lid. Seal the bag opening with the green sealing cap. Lift out and check the pre-motor filter located under the vacuum bag. Clean or replace. Drop in the new bag, leaving the flap over the catch spring on the left and locating in the three position lugs. Simply push the lid closed. Replacing the exhaust filter. Remove the clips as indicated. Replace with new filter and refit the clips. Brush replacement. Press release button on the base. Twist and remove the end cap. Pull out roller. Push in new brush. Twist the end cap back in place. Red light illuminates on base of machine. If this illuminates, it means the brush roller is jammed or the brush is worn out. Check the brush roller is running smoothly. If not, look for obstructions and remove. If the brush is worn out, replace as previously demonstrated. Once completed, simply switch back on to start. If the machine loses suction and the bag full indicator shows full, but the bag is not full, you have a blockage. All parts of the dust path can be accessed without the need for any tools. Starting at the top, open the bag lid. Check for obstruction in the hose assembly. Unlock base from body by pressing the button on the neck. Pull body off the base. Look down the neck of the base to the trapdoor on the underside of the base. Then from the trapdoor to the roller. This is the complete dust path. Reassemble in reverse order. Thank you.